Hi guys, welcome to this session in Microsoft Word. In this module, I want to show you how you can keep words together no matter what line they're on. So they will always drop onto the next line as a set. Whether that's two words, three words or four words, they will always be together. So for example, if I type um, Metropolitan Borough District Council, that's a quick part abbreviation for it when I click on that I've already set this up so that if this gets to the if one of these gets to the end of the line it the whole lot of it will just drop down so if I just do a few space bars to get that to the end of the page you'll see what I mean it just drops down as a set so we're coming close now so the whole group of words dropped as a set now how have I done that? So basically what I've done is, is used a non-breaking space from the insert symbols dialog box. If I put show hide on, you'll see the spaces I've just done there to get across. But you can see these little circles in this. That's the non-breaking space character that's basically gluing this together as one complete set. Now if I take show hide off and if I just come down the line after that and I'll type that again and I'll show you how I did it so basically type it out first of all Metropolitan Borough District so this is how it would be if you didn't glue it together I'll just show you this bit District Council so normally when you go, to, if I just do exactly the same thing, just space bar this across, when I get to the end, it'll start dropping down word at a time, which is obviously what I've avoided doing in the other one, in this, in this line. So that's what I'm going to try and stop happening. I'll come back just to the edge of the line so I don't have to go all the way across. So what I've done is I basically got rid of that gap, went to the insert tab, and symbols and in there I went to more symbols and then where I need to be is special characters and non breaking space and that's the key command for it so my cursor is in the correct position I can click insert and it just moves it along now if I do the same on this one so this box basically floats so you can you can keep it on the screen and then just insert them so I'll get rid of that one as well get my cursor there backspace insert now that's it done you can't see it at the moment but if I close that box and put show hide back on you'll see those little circles that I pointed out earlier on you can see those little circles so now if I just do a few more spaces this whole thing will drop down as a set as opposed to individual words like that so non breaking space is what keeps sets of words together that should always be together like Newcastle United for example or Leeds United you don't want United going on the second line when the, the first part of it's on, a, on the line above so non-breaking space is the character that you use and then that's what will keep it together so hopefully this video has been of use thank you for your time and i'll catch you on the next one